Hi, I'm Sarah. I'm a med, I'm a mentor with the Get Magic program, and I'm here to interview uh, Sia about her project with her mentor, Ira. Um, would you like to introduce yourself quickly? First, we'll do Ira, and then we'll have Sia. Thank you. Hi, Sarah. My name is Ira Pramanik. Um, I'm the founder of Magic. I'm, I'm also a software engineer at Google. And this summer, it was my privilege to mentor Sia, who was an intern with Magic. Um, my name's Sia, and I'm a junior in Moreau Catholic High School in Hayward. I was previously a mentee in seventh grade, and now I'm an intern. And I just had so much fun, and I feel like I learned so much from Ira during this internship, so I'm so happy. That's fantastic, Sia. It's so great to have you back. Um, how, how would you say your projects were different between when you were first a mentee and when you're a, now that you're an intern? Well, I think when I was a mentee, it was a lot of like about just getting my feet wet with like the programming. And this time it was more so like, I feel like this was more like applicable to like the real world. Like if I wanted to go to a, like a software job, this was more applicable. And this one was just, I feel like I, I had like a direction and I really like went with it this time. Last time, I think I was very like confused with like where I wanted to go, what I wanted to do. So I really felt like my head was clearer this time. Yeah. Uh, that's really great. That sounds awesome. What, um, can you describe your project a little bit? Uh, yeah, so my project is the Magic Menti Project website. And it basically archives and displays past Menti projects and gives mentees the ability to add their own projects in the future. And they have to first pass a login form that's powered by Firebase to go through that just to add an extra layer of security. Oh, that is really great. Ira, how does this um, contribute to the magic program in general? I think it's a, it's a great contribution. So we started this effort, I think two summers ago when I was like, it would be really nice to show past mentee projects, but it should be actually implemented by mentees. So we had the previous mentee was, uh, the previous intern was also a mentee with us. And so she spent some time with another mentor last summer designing the, the interface um, and then also actually populating uh, the projects. But that was again a 10 week thing. So that's too short for, uh, to actually make it production ready. So we really wanted obviously to complete this project so that, you know, to hopefully very soon we can have it on our website as something that was created by mentees that showcases past mentee projects. So I think it's going to be um, very uh, significant strategically because often when we go to new schools or even parents, you know, they want to know what, what do girls exactly do? So now you can just point it to them saying, here are the projects. And by the way, the whole thing has been implemented by past mentees. That, what a what a great idea and what a great showcase. I, I love it. That's so fantastic. Sia, what was the biggest challenge for you for over the, um, with this with this project, either the first time or this time? Um, this time, I think it was a lot of, well, last time the biggest issue was being able to look forward, I guess. Like, just, I didn't, I didn't know what my end goal was, I guess. And so this time, I feel like that was very clear. So I'm very happy about that. I'd say this time my biggest challenge was um, staying organized and I guess managing my time. Like, you know, like I was preparing for SATs during this time and like, you know, it was just very hectic, but I think learning how to prioritize and learning how to just know what's important, and what's not. And so, yeah. Wow, that is so insightful. I, I struggle with that every day. I wish I had those <laughs> skills as well. That's fantastic. What, what would you tell other girls who are interested in the magic program? I'd say go for it. Like, I mean, I think what's like, what's so different about magic than anything I've ever done is like how like involved everyone is. And because of that, like, for example, the ask me anything sessions, those are just like, I remember going out of that and being like, just feeling so empowered before that, I wasn't sure if I wanted to go into software in the future. And after that, I was just like, you know, I think I can do it. And like, I think just, I just want to tell like people, like it does develop you in ways other than just coding. Like you don't have to, it's not just sitting behind a screen and like watching videos on YouTube about how to code. It's really getting out there and like practicing all of the skills that you need to like be successful. 
Oh, that's fantastic. That's so wonderful to hear. I feel like that's something that the mentors get out of it as well, is that, that growth and, and that learning experience, not just about the technical aspects, but about everything as a, as a whole. That's really great. Thank you. I'm so, thank you so much for your contribution to magic again. And it's an exciting um, to be, for you to be a part of magic's future as well. Thank you so much for this interview. Yeah. Thank, thank you. you Sarah. Bye. Bye.